Will Maddie in the Morning be on the airwaves tomorrow? The question comes as the Boston radio show host threatened to quit on air this morning. As WBZ's Christina Rex reports, he says management is trying to silence him. He's been a staple on Boston radio for 40 years. And now, this is Maddie in the Morning. On the morning commute, people turn to Matt Siegel or Maddie in the morning. Let me just stop here for a second. But on Wednesday morning, fans got a different kind of sign off. Well, I hope you're happy as I just stopped talking. Maddie out. The longtime DJ appeared to quit on the air. It started with a conversation about Demi Lovato. I want to take this moment to share something very personal with you. The pop star announced Wednesday that they identify as non-binary and will go by they slash them pronouns. When Maddie joked about it on the air, he says his boss called him and told him to stop talking. Then this happened. I am the biggest of all time. And they said, shut up, Matt. Stop talking. Tweets came flying in, like Maddie finally canceled, we won. Shout out to Demi for being powerful enough to take down Maddie. And LOL, Maddie quit live on air because he wasn't allowed to make fun of non-binary people. The national organization GLAD tells WBZ these gender neutral pronouns are not new, just newly accepted. So if anyone, um, you know, is, is disrespectful or sort of waves those pronouns away and poo-poos it as woke culture or a new thing, they're really not being accurate. I think it's insane. Comedian Lenny Clark, a longtime friend and frequent guest of Maddie in the Morning, says he thinks this is cancel culture at its worst, and he's hoping Maddie did not sign off for good. And I mean, if someone can make us laugh and, and cheer us up in the morning, all the better. And I, I really sincerely hope that Maddie Siegel is back tomorrow morning. We called Matt Siegel multiple times, but we didn't get a response. Though he did tell the Boston Globe he plans to be on the air tomorrow to talk about what happened. In Boston, Christina Rex, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.